When did the class clown go way too far? There was this guy in my chemistry class who was known for his outrageous pranks and would constantly disrupt lessons for laughs. He once set off the fire alarm with a homemade smoke bomb and got detention for a month. Everyone thought he'd learned his lesson, but his first day back proved we were all wrong. We were in the middle of a lab experiment when our teacher stepped out to grab some supplies. This guy immediately turns to us with this mischievous grin and whispers, watch this. Before anyone could stop him, he grabs a beaker of what he thought was just colored water and announces he's going to chug it to become a superhero. Despite Despite everyone shouting at him to stop, he downs the entire beaker in one gulp. Within seconds, his face went from triumphant to horrified. He started coughing violently and clutching his throat. We all froze, suddenly realizing this wasn't just another stupid prank. His eyes were watering, and he was gasping for air when he stumbled backward, knocking over a shelf of glass equipment that shattered everywhere. Then, he just collapsed, convulsing on the floor surrounded by broken glass. Our teacher rushed back in after hearing the crash and immediately went pale. She screamed at someone to pull the emergency shower while she called for help on the classroom phone. I'll never forget the sound of the alarm blaring as two teachers held him under the emergency shower, trying to rinse whatever chemical he'd swallowed off his skin and out of his mouth. His lips had turned a terrifying shade of blue, and some girls in the corner were sobbing uncontrollably while the rest of us were evacuated from the lab. He spent two weeks in the hospital with chemical burns to his esophagus and was expelled from school. Turns out he had drunk a diluted copper sulfate solution that was meant for our crystal growing experiment. The chemistry lab was closed for a month after and we had to have counselors come talk to our class about the incident. Nobody thought pranks were funny after that.